Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel and if you're new, what up? Today I'm going to be rating the Bath & Body Works Tropical Line, at least all of the items that I have in my possession currently. And I do have some of the scents from last year so the packaging is a bit different but it's the same scent so i'm going to be rating them and letting you guys know why i rate certain scents higher than others my thoughts on them my opinions and just letting you guys know overall why i feel like the ones that got rated the highest are rated the highest so if you guys are interested in seeing that then just keep on watching oh yeah i forgot before we get started i do have one scent here that they didn't come back out with this year and i think that's because it is a repackage so i will be letting you guys know about that once i get to that specific scent also i do have all of the lotions for these scents but i'm only going to be showing you guys the fragrance mist because i just feel like y'all don't need to see the lotions so i just have the fragrance mist and yeah we can go ahead and get started so if you're new here and you don't really know me or much about my scent preferences i am a very sweet fruity gourmand lover so anything that smells fruity candy like sweet vanilla caramel food like i am very into those scents i can do floral scents and i can do fresh scents if they have some type of fruity or floral element to them but my ultimate scent preference is definitely sweet i am a sweet type of girl and so that majorly influenced me rating some of these very very high so just because i rate certain scents low does not mean that i don't like these scents i love every single one of these scents and i do recommend every single one of these scents it's just that some are better than others and if it were down to you know like which ones are my favorite 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 then i would definitely have to choose certain ones so i'm gonna stop rambling and i'm gonna get into it so the first scent i have here is fiji sunshine guavatini so this is my first top rated number one scent that i feel like you should get from the tropical line in my opinion if you are a very sweet loving person like myself because this literally smells like candy fiji sunshine guavatini is so ridiculously sweet and fruity but i feel like that is what makes it perfect for warm weather just simply because when it's hot outside you don't want anything too heavy on your body you don't want anything too cloying on your body you kind of want something light airy sweet and just not drowning you in scent and so i feel like fiji sunshine guavatini is just that i'm gonna give you guys the notes because i do have the cream right here this is sunkissed guava fresh orange and seaside jasmine so so it's a very simplistic scent it is very sweet and fruity the guava in here is really super sugary sweet but you do get a little bit of citrus now that i see that it has fresh orange you do get a little bit of citrus in here but this is such a beautiful scent again this is the packaging from last year but they did bring this scent out again this year with the tropical line so you can literally go to your store right now and buy this i just feel like this is the ultimate warm weather scent it is so gorgeous so beautiful i definitely will be pulling this out this year by the way i will be doing a whole video on scents that i will be using coming this spring so stay tuned for that because i'm going to be pulling a lot of good ones from out of my collection to use this spring so yeah fiji sunshine guavatini is my number one recommendation the next recommendation i have is going to be raspberry tangerine because again this is so sweet fruity oh but this is so good you definitely get that citrus note in here so this one has more of a tangy note to it than fiji sunshine guavatini even though the fiji had that fresh orange this one you definitely can smell some citrus in there it is so good in here with the raspberry you mostly get the raspberry but it definitely smells like this tart sweet fruity berry scent it is really pretty i also have the lotion here so i'm going to read the notes it is wild raspberries fresh tangerine lemon zest definitely smell the tangerine definitely smell that lemon zest like i said it's very tart but it's super sweet because of those wild raspberries and again this is just another perfect scent for warm weather to be light and airy and not too heavy not smelling like musk or woods or you know just something really heavy so I just feel like raspberry tangerine is also a good one to go for the packaging is different this year 
same scent though so my next scent this one is going to include the coconut in it because i do like coconut i do like coconut scents i'm from miami so i just i love anything tropical and so my next scent that i highly recommend is key west i love this scent you guys i wore this the other day and it was just so good i really enjoyed the time that i wore this because this one while it is sweet this one is more of a fresh scent this actually smells like coconut water and a melon but not a super super juicy sweet melon but more like the watery part of the melon if you guys understand what i'm saying that's how fresh this smells but again it does have some sweetness to it so it says coconut water salt water waves and fresh melon i don't really get anything salty in here but I believe that's just the freshness that you're getting in this scent. This is beautiful. This is gorgeous. This definitely smells like vacation in a bottle. I would definitely take this with me if I were to go somewhere warm and fun and tropical for a vacation. This would be the scent that I would take because to me, this one hits all corners. I really like the color of this packaging. Doesn't it just look like tropical goodness? It looks like the water when you go somewhere tropical or when you go to an island so definitely recommend key west coconut water and melon the next one i have y'all this one shocked me okay this one shocked me i just didn't expect to like it as much as i do but this is sunwash citrus you guys this is what sunwash citrus looks like and this packaging describes it accurately okay the name describes it accurately so this is sugared lemons mandarin and agave nectar sunwash citrus gives me sunny delight vibes the drink i don't know if you guys remember that or if your kids drink it but sunny delight it reminds me of that this smells so refreshing and just so nice and citrusy again i'm from miami and so i grew up drinking hella orange juice eating hella oranges just all type of citrus fruits and so smelling this is just it's doing something for me this smells so super good and i'm liking that bath and body works isn't making the citrus fragrances really really like tart and tangy and zesty this one is one that i definitely recommend and it is number four on the list because it's just so good again it's fruity and it's bright and it's airy and it's gonna make you smell like summer like how you're supposed to smell when the weather is warm outside so that one is number four number five is going to be waikiki beach coconut i included waikiki beach coconut so far up the list just because this scent has scent memories attached to it i remember i took this when me and my family went to orlando we went on a trip down there and this is the scent that i took with me and it smells amazing i loved it so much the entire time we were there this is what i wore and it was so good so uh, i have the scent notes right here this is beach coconut pink passion flower saltwater breeze fresh bamboo and sun bleached woods so waikiki beach coconut isn't a super sweet fragrance candy like like the other ones that i've showed you guys already but waikiki beach coconut does smell very beachy it does smell a little bit salty it does smell fresh it does smell coconutty and so i just feel like it encompasses everything that is summer and tropical and warm weather it smells exactly how this packaging looks okay it smells like a beachy dream vacation and i feel like you can smell everything in this like it says beach coconut because it is definitely more of that fresh type of coconut smell like when you like first crack open a coconut um it definitely smells like floral some florals in there salt i definitely get something salty in here i definitely get some woods it's a good one i really like waikiki beach coconut and again like i said it has scent memories attached to it so she's pretty high up on the list so that is number five number six is going to be coconut pineapple 
Now, the coconut line, I highly recommend the entire coconut line. It is so good. It's gonna be amazing for layering with fragrances. You definitely need these for layering because they just, they're gonna go with anything because they are so simplistic. Unlike the rest of these scents, these are very, very simple in what they are. So, coconut pineapple is shaved coconut, fresh pineapple and sugar cane, and this, really does smell like shaved coconut and pineapple honestly key west and coconut pineapple smell kind of similar i guess the coconut that they put in both of these scents is the same but they smell really really sim um similar but coconut pineapple is just a juicy fruity coconut so that is exactly why i had to put it before the other coconuts in this collection this one just it smells divine and i love that they added sugar to it so it is not just a fresh coconut it smells a little bit more sugary and i'm into that so i really do enjoy this one next we have the original coconut so i had to put the original coconut in here because this smells so amazing on my skin it kind of smells like coconut cake or something like for whatever reason this is really 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 sweet on my skin so it is coconut milk sea salt musk and fresh vanilla Again, this is not a super fresh coconut because instead it is coconut milk, which means it's been mixed with something. It's sweeter, it's softer, it's creamier. And so I guess that's why I'm getting more of like a cake scent on my skin. And then it also has fresh vanilla in it as well. And we all know vanilla sweetens up damn near any fragrance. And so I had to put the original coconut next because this one is just so good. It is really, really nice absolutely love it so yes that is number what number is that so this one is number seven okay rating that number seven also by the way you guys this is a repackage of bali black coconut sands so this is from i believe this is from 2019 yes this is from 2019 but i know they had bali black coconut sands at the sas it was in this packaging hold on so i only got a mini at sas but this is the packaging that it was in for the winter sas that just passed so if you have any of these bali black coconut sands packaging this coconut is a repackage of that. So, Bali Black Coconut Sands is coconut milk, tonka bean, jasmine, sea salt musk, and black sand. And like I said, for the coconut, it's coconut milk, sea salt musk, and fresh vanilla. So, basically, they just took this fragrance and they made it into a coconut fragrance. I was just like, hold on, wait, 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 because... I wanted to do this rating of all of my scents in my collection from the tropical line and I just so happened to pull this out and I smelled it because I was like why didn't they bring Bali black coconut sands back out I saw it at the SAS why didn't they bring it back out and when I smelled it that's when I was just like okay no wonder they didn't bring it back out because it's basically coconut oh the cream smells amazing I need to pull this back out Oh, this smells so amazing, you guys. It smells very, very similar to coconut. It's pretty much a repackage. So, yeah, if you don't want to buy coconut this year because you already have Bali Black Coconut Sands from SAS or from previous years, I do not blame you. So, the next one is going to be Coconut Lime. I am wearing this today, and I love Coconut Lime. This one is really good. It's zesty, it's zingy, but it's not too much again. Like I said with the other fragrances that have citrus in it, it's not too zesty, it's not too zingy. It is perfect, they mix the notes perfect. I don't know if you guys can see, but I use a lot of this today. I'm like down to here. I'm literally like down to here on this fragrance. I use a lot of it today. I'm, matter of fact, I'm about to spray some more on because it smells so, so, so good. And I did mix it with a perfume today. But this smells so good. So it is coconut cream, sparkling lime, salt water waves. To me, this smells like some type of seltzer water with coconut and lime added to it. It has a fizziness to it, and I guess that's the sparkling lime. Um, the coconut cream, again, it's more of a creamy coconut. It's not fresh. And then it has salt water waves. It does have a little bit of like this, 
<sighs> like I said, it smells like a seltzer water or something or some type of drink. Like, you know how you put the salt on the rim? So it smells like an alcoholic drink with a little bit of salt on the rim. I guess a margarita. It smells so good and I really do enjoy it. But I had to put it last in the coconut lineup because this one is more fresh and zesty. Whereas the other ones are more sweet and up my alley. So that's number eight. Okay, last two cents, you guys. Last two. And again, just because these are the last two cents and they are rated low in my scheme does not mean that I don't like these scents. I really do enjoy them. It's just... I like these other ones better okay so we have bahamas passion fruit and banana flower another one that they brought back out this year and i was so excited when i saw that bath and body works did a fragrance with a banana note in it but apparently banana flower does not smell like banana but in this scent i definitely get something reminiscent of banana but the keynotes are passion fruit, pineapple leaves, freesia petals, banana flower, and amber. So I really do like this scent because I definitely smell some florals in here. Definitely smell some pineapple, amber, banana. I feel like I, I definitely smell banana in here regardless of whether banana flowers smell like banana or not. I definitely get something in here and the amber just makes this nice and warm this would be a beautiful scent for nighttime so if you have any type of gatherings at night bonfires you know things like that this would be perfect to wear because that amber kind of makes this a deeper warmer scent and i just feel like on a cool summer night it would be super super nice to wear and so i do like this fragrance it's just not as good as the other ones but i'm definitely going to get some use out of it this coming summer and the very last scent i have is belize so I only got a small size of Belize, but that's okay because I got a full size body cream as well as a mini size body cream. So it's okay. And Belize is banana daiquiri, juicy pineapples, and golden sands. So uh, this smells so good, you guys. This smells like banana runts candy. So while yes, it does smell like candy and you would think I would have rated it higher. I just feel like this is a scent that I am going to get tired of quickly. Yeah, I just... I liked it when I was in store, which is why I was just like, you know what, let me go ahead and get the travel size body cream because it's a free item with my coupon. And then let me also pick up the um, body cream during the five, um, what it was, the $5.95 body cream sale. Uh, so yeah, I picked it up, but as I was, you know, just trying these scents out and everything, when I am wearing Belize on my skin for long periods of time, I do feel like I can get tired of it if this was a scent that I was wearing constantly. So with Belize, I'm going to have to take it easy and not wear it as much, give myself breaks when I'm wearing it. But this is a beautiful scent. Like I said, it smells like banana runts candy. So if you're into those, then you definitely need to pick this up. This packaging is beautiful. I love the gold and the pink and the palm trees. I think they did a really good job with the packaging on the new tropical line some people like the packaging from last year just simply because they had like you know actual pictures on the packaging and everything i honestly like both sometimes i can go for the simplistic packaging sometimes i can go for the picturesque packaging it it just it all depends but those are all the scents that i have in my collection and i just gave you all my ratings i put them in order from the ones that i like the most to the ones that i still like but not as much because i don't want to say the ones i like the least because i do really like all of these scents i hope you guys enjoyed if you did go ahead and give it a big thumbs up leave me a comment down below letting me know that you enjoyed it if you are new definitely go ahead and hit that subscribe button one more thing one more thing that i want to say to you guys um the best way for you guys to support my channel and the free way to support my channel is just by simply watching the ads on my videos you don't have to contribute anything you don't have to come out of pocket anything all you have to do is just spend a little bit of time with me watching my videos as well as watching the ads on my videos and that is the best way that you can support this channel so on that note, if you are new, definitely go ahead and hit that subscribe button as well as the bell notification so that you can be notified every single time that I upload a video. And I'll see you guys in my next one. Peace.